looking, feel younger, but that pursuit for the fountain of youth, it's not limited just to the outside of our bodies. Check it out. So I'm here in Dr. Weiss's office. I've been struggling with stress urinary incontinence and vaginal dryness, vaginal irritation, urinary frequency and urgency, and I'm done with it. I'm over it. And I'm so excited about this new procedure that can help me. And I was also told that it helps tighten things up a little bit, too. Hi! All right, Jen. You ready to do this? You're my favorite guy. Don't be nervous. I'm nervous. I watched a YouTube on how to do it, so we're okay. <laughs> So what the Mona Lisa does is a CO2 fractionated laser treats women who have atrophic vaginitis, so in menopause, the thinning out the dryness of the cells. I'm not in menopause yet. Right. Just to be clear. Yeah. <laughs> so what we're finding now, it does increase blood flow, they're called angiogenesis. New blood flow grows into the tissue. Really? So, so it'll be juicier and youthful and... You explain it so much better than I do. <laughs> All right, I'm going to get you set up. Okay. And we'll go do our uh, our laser. This is the probe. It has markers along the side of each centimeter. We put the probe in, and it shoots the laser. We can't use any lubricant when we put the probe in because it's a CO2 laser, and it has what we call affinity, as you know, to water. So we're going to put the probe in. Have to relax. You're done. Oh my gosh! I survived. You did Thank great. You. you did great. Procedure with Dr. Berman. Dr. Peter Weiss joins us. When you do a procedure like this, what are the what are the main things you're looking to improve or treat? A great question, and that's a really important thing. So, it's a beautiful video. It makes fun, and it makes light of a real medical condition. So, when we talk about menopause in men, we have so many other avenues that we can deal for sexual function. Women who go into menopause, and this was really geared back in Italy about three, four years ago for women who've had breast cancer who could not take estrogen. So the woman's vagina becomes very thin in menopause, or if you have breast cancer, you can't take estrogen to treat it. So the laser stimulates, goes down into the real uh, uh, meat of the area where it'll have new cells grow, new blood flow. Really what the Mona Lisa Touch laser is, right. a CO2 fractional laser, and you right. use Which I use on the face. all the time. Yes. This is a specific type of probe that's FDA approved for the vaginal tissue. It's something called the DECA pulse. I can go all the science, but it's really geared to reinvigorate and stimulate the growth of healthy tissue in women, primarily who've gone into menopause, who have the thinning of the tissue, becomes pain with intercourse. That's where it works. And in my practice, we're finding about 90% so, improvement with it. And obviously, Dr. Berman, you have access to a lot of therapies, technologies, Dr. Weiss. So as far as anyone watching at home, how much does it cost as far as... Uh, another very good question. So when women go into menopause, after about four years of menopause, about 60% of women will have complaints such as this with a dry... Uh, vaginal tissue, pain with intercourse, bladder function, things like that. So it really does affect a great number of women just going through menopause itself, and then you have other women who have issues from breast cancer and, and, and so other bladder cost. issues. The cost varies. Insurance doesn't cover it. It depends yeah, on what... Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Well, it, it may or may not, but, but the bottom line is between $500 to $1,000 of treatment. You need three treatments, three treatments. six weeks and apart, and then you get one year's and then you're fine. And then every year you do a maintenance. So that's really what, what it really gears. And we have phenomenal response. You want to know well, Jen, how just, doing? just a couple of days, how are you doing? Well, Jen? I do notice more vaginal, I mean, not to be lewd, but more youthful, like when I was younger, kind of secretions going on. That, that's a very common <laughs> response. And, and what happens, like you know from when you do the CO2 laser of the mm -hmm. face, the cells start to grow. So you see a response within about two weeks. Uh, and the uh, that's for the initial treatment. And the reason you do three treatments is because the cells will start to sort of die off again. So once you do those three treatments, you get about a one year. Uh, but I'm having the other thing actually that no I love. frequency and urgency. I will say, frequency, ur which I have all the time, frequency urgency is gone. Zero. Wow. I haven't awesome. even gone to death. Well, and what is so great about this technology, and lasers are improving, it seems, weekly, is so many more options for, you don't like the word rejuvenation, but... This, it's non-surgical, and so it's so much more benign in terms of some of the other things that may have to be done. So I, I think this is a great option, and Dr. Weiss, thanks so much for sharing My this pleasure. with us.